from the higher ed center to yesterday's volleyball game we've, we've got, got the, the scoop. scoop please stand for the pledge of allegiance ready begin to the flag of the united states of america and to the republic for which it stands one nation under god indivisible with liberty and justice for all Today is Friday, October 6, 2017. Hope you guys are having a great morning and had a balanced breakfast. Hey guys, it's, uh, it's us again. Danny and Vesna are back here live at the Inside Scoop studio. Bringing you some local Centurion news. Let's get started off with clubs. But first, we have Mr. Michael for an announcement about the PSAT and the SAT. Take it away, Mr. Michael. Good morning, Centurions, first of all. I'd like to wish the uh, football team good luck tonight. I'd put the jersey on, but it's a little too small. All right, next Wednesday, we will do the PSAT and the SAT test. It's a very important test for both 9th through 11th and especially our 12th graders. It's very important that we follow some uh, expectations. Number one, seniors. It is extremely important that you bring a form of identification. The identification must have a current picture on it. It can be a driver's license, it can be a state ID, or it can be your school ID. Secondly, all 9th through 12th graders on either the PSAT or the SAT may use a calculator. Please make sure that you bring a calculator that has fresh batteries. And finally, it's extremely important that we all arrive at 730. Failing to do so will extend the testing day. So we want to try and get started on both tests as soon as possible. So again, Please arrive next Wednesday by 7.30. You will be assigned testing rooms. Seniors, you will be testing in the gym. So seniors, you do not report to first period. We will take attendance in the gym. Thank you very much. Have a great weekend. See you tonight at the homecoming football game. Following the game, we'll see you at the dance. Thank you, Mr. Michael. All right, Vesta, what clubs do we have today? Well, Danny, we have the Higher Ed Center here at Century Monday through Friday from 3 to 6. Oh, yeah, I remember that. They do interview tips, college explorations, and job opportunities. Basically, Basically they, they pretty much help with how to construct a good resume and cover letters so that you can send to the company that is interested in hiring teams. Hold up, you forgot something. Scholarships, they help the students. Look for scholarships helping students of money for college. Great, Vesta. But another thing is, don't forget about this upcoming play called And Then There Were None, made by our drama club here at Century. Pre-sale tickets are $4, and uh, at the door tickets cost $8. And that play happens on the 13th, so get your tickets and don't miss it. Here's a little teaser once again for the play. Ladies and gentlemen, Ooh, the master of my sea, oh, ooh, 
I was broken from a young age, taking my soak into the masses, writing my poems for the few that look at me, took to me, shook at me, feeling me, singing from heartache, from the pain, taking my message from the veins, speaking my lesson from the brain, seeing the beauty through the... I'm the one, the only, the unknown, Owen. Is that it? Are you a Latina? Are you interested in becoming a leader? Interested in going to college? If so, then this field trip is for you. The, tech, the Teach Academy is inviting all Latina students to sign up for the Cordia University second annual Latina Leadership Conference, which will be had at the Cordia uh, University on Saturday, October 21st from 9 to 2. Transportation and lunch will be provided by the Teach Academy. This opportunity is open to all Latina students in all grades. Interested students must sign up with Mr. Ov Ovison in room 5201 by Friday the 13th. Now today is our first assembly assembly <laughs> here at Century and our friends here at the Inside Scoop. Evelyn and Jennifer went to the gym to record and get a sneak peek of the assembly. Roll the clip. Good morning Centurions. So you know what today is. It's our assembly and we came to take a sneak peek. Let's <laughs> about your first assemblies good we've been training for um, weeks now feel pretty confident um, ROTC here we have our football guys ready for their assembly fire people here um, preparing for today's assembly I know we said this before, but if you have F's and you know you are struggling with your homework, please attend tutoring. Tutoring is open every day of the week. Monday is from 1 to 4, and the rest of the week is from 3 to 6. So go to the tutoring. I promise you, people are there to help you better understand your homework, and I bet you will bring up those F's. Now let's get us <laughs> go into some sports. The volleyball had a game yesterday at Savannah and they told us that they did well. So here we have a video of yesterday's game. Roll the clip. <laughs> Hi, I'm Stephanie Rodriguez and I'm here at Savannah where our ladies and turns are going to be playing versus Savannah. So wish them luck. Great job girls, taking the W and giving Savannah the L. Keep it up, remember that if you see something worth mentioning, take a picture of it and hashtag this is Century. Well unfortunately Vesta, that is it for today's news. We gotta sign off now. Wow, funny how time flies. Let's wrap this up. I'm Vesna. And I'm Danny. Came at you, we came at you live from the Inside Scoop studio and remember, show courage, intelligence, and pride in being a Centurion. Bye.